Hello YouTube, Obistoro66 here, and welcome back to Zero Caliber. And today we are making some crazy customizations once again with weapons. So we're going to test out some more crazy combinations. So let's look here. So if you guys remember that one video we did with this garbage heap of a weapon, which this gun actually does suck. And I don't know why people decide to use this sometimes. But I also want to test out another one, which kind of like would be like my idea of trying to find a different creation of a gun. So here, we're gonna, uh, what do you wanna choose? I think we're gonna choose this. And then, uh, we're gonna go here, here, there. I don't know if I did this for one of the videos. I probably did, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. Hold on. I love this combination I did here. This it looks really good. This looks like really cool. If you guys know, if you guys saw the uh, last episode we did on Zero Cover, that was uh, quite hilarious to say the least. So basically, during that episode, we had um, what it what happened there in the episode? I think, oh yeah, right. I'm stupid. So basically, I uh, I was like, I moved around like an AI, and my friend shot me because he. I said, dude, why are you shooting me? He says, cause move around like an AI, and I was like. It's like really, and, he, and then he, I just, uh, and then I went all ham. I decided to twist my gun around like this, like I was going like this, just shooting it like this. If you guys go check that out, it was actually really hilarious. Like I'm not gonna lie, it was funny. Anyway, here we're gonna go to, uh, we're gonna continue training our because I'm not willing to get demonetized today for f bombs, even though this is, I'm not getting paid for anything on here. I just want to say it's just better for the future of the channel someone's gonna say that that it doesn't really matter but i'm pretty sure it does D it does to me though like <laughs> also just because i want to do this real quick i want to see if this is possible to snipe with a pistol i want to see if this is possible It is possible. So. This gun never gets old. This revolver, I love it. So I was gonna say I suck at aiming, but here's the thing: you can't put a grip on here, and it's not against the ledge, and so I don't want to hear it. I hate to say it, but I feel like someone in the comments is gonna say that. Cause someone did comment on something about one of the, the people who one of the people who were in one of my videos when I did that server thing. I knew, I think I know who they were talking about. They were talking about the one guy in the episode. I'm trying to find him in servers, but you guys know who I'm talking about. It's the guy who basically had the Tommy gun from one of the episodes. Get you! Get, like, like basically, basically, um, he was um uh, in that like it was. What was it? It was that one episode where we were in a World War II battlefield. And he was on my server, so then I thought, like, since he subscribed, I was wondering if I could find him. And I hope he, I hope he looks at the front. There are some people who play this game, and I'm, like, wondering, do people actually have a problem with my channel? Like, like I mean, honestly, yeah, I am OB Star 66, but just because I do Star stuff is because I don't want to, like... I can deal, I guess, with, like, copyright, like, copyright claim due to, like, stuff, like, songs and stuff. That's why there's no music in this video, in these videos, except for the game's actual music, because, like, last time I got copyright strike, the video got muted for, for the rest of the, uh, for the, for the rest of the video, for the rest of the time of it. I fixed it, so that way it was muted, that way I didn't have that issue. It said reason, copyright, and then now I know why, because it was a song. I thought copyright claim meant that, like, I clicked on it for claim, which... That's only you, I guess uh, Disney caught me in the act or someone, or the creator caught my video and I was like, oh, crud, I am so dead, like, so I guess they don't have a problem with me unless I'm using their music or something, because I feel like that happened, that was really, that really did suck though, uh, actually guys, I think we're gonna also start now moving on to like different types of pistols now for the next challenge, because I think it'd be kind of funny to do it, 
but the one thing I am gonna do here. Okay, here, look at this, guys. I'm gonna do this. Even though I'm gonna have to change my loadout after this episode, which that's gonna be lovely. Sarcastically saying that. Hmm. I think I want to go with this silencer because it matches the uh, the the like front end of it. I'm saying something. Like I'm trying to. What I'm saying is the front end. It it uh, it just looks good. It matches the barrel front. What's the front pa part of a gun? Let me know. Not, not the barrel. It's the tube piece. Um, someone let me know in the comments what it is, because I have no idea. Ugh, I've been shaking a lot. I don't know why. I guess it's because like. It's early in the morning, I'm like tired and stuff. It's like, it's weird. It's like early in the morning, I'm like, like not even like, like fully awake yet. And it's like, this is what I'm doing. It's like playing a video game where you have to focus a lot. But you don't have to completely focus in Zero Caliber. You just gotta like, keep in mind, you know? It's easy though. It's weird how like in this part of the game, opposed to the regular Zero Caliber, which can people in Zero Caliber, like really in the, in the other version, like the PC version, can you actually like, Drop your mags and do that. Because I'm only in the comments if you can do that. Because I'm curious. I'm just curious, you know. It's also surprising how like people who play this game, like, understand what I try to do for a living. Like I do this for a living and not for an actual job, even though I'm trying to get a job. The people are gonna say that I'm being an absolute moron. I'm trying not to be in my life, I'm trying to be more independent, thinking about the future when I when I want to be able to move out after, after like a couple of years if I have enough money, like I'll try to save up on money. But people try to do that and you know how that goes. Like if you're a freeloader, do not be a freeloader. Like I watched a video, a couple of videos of people who are freeloaders, those people are absolute dog water. And to understand to get money is the best way to do it. Oh, I'm so dead here if I get shot again. I think I'm better than I was last time when I did this challenge. Because I remember I did this challenge. Guess what happened? I died. So, that worked very well. But it depends on the difficulty level of the of the game, I guess. Accuracy is 36. I'm trying to get better accuracy, guys. Like, I'm trying. It'd be funny. Like, I try to make sure that in my life I could, like, gain, like, a ton of subscribers in, in one go. Are you guys wondering why I'm saying that? It's just because, like, I hope to, like, one day, like, we gained, so, like, a couple subscribers, which I'm thankful for. And I really do, ho do hope they enjoy the content that I try to post. Even though it may seem weird for me to tear stuff, that's also, if you check the about section, which this is for people who are new on my channel, please check the about section. It explains a lot more on why I do this stuff. It explains it, though, very well, very thoroughly, and just perfect, on, on a sense. Like, it just, like makes it a lot more easier <sighs> sometimes i also think before i speak and just to let you guys know that's why i'm kind of talking while thinking before i s try not to think before i speak and it's like i don't know why i have that problem but i do and it's a dumb problem it's more likely like like here we're gonna try our the custom like shotgun loader that i have here which honestly looks ridiculous in itself I add a lot of lasers onto my stuff now to just because I can't like add a grip onto these things. But it makes it a lot more fun. Like who else has done this stuff, right? Like the shotgun sounds so weird when it when it has a silencer on it. But if you put a certain silencer on it, you can make these shotguns long range. Which I know which which piece it is. It's very easy to figure out which one it is. Like, like you actually can make these uh, long range. All it takes is a certain silencer to help you with it. I need to take over. Take over. What is wrong with me?
try to get him. I feel like I'm running around like a little animal. If you're wondering why I'm doing, I'm wiping my, like, ugh, it's just the brush I'm selling off my face, guys. Though it doesn't look weird. I know it looks weird from what you guys are seeing, but from what I'm seeing, it's just me brushing my hand, like, away from my face. Or something, like, brushing something off my face. Anyway, I think if there's another, like, other design we can go for. Which I have a loadout specifically, like, designed in a sense for craziness, which this looks stupid in itself because of the laser, but it's fine in my mind. I would say the AK also deserves a point because here's the thing, that laser is not supposed to go on there. It's like mounted in the wrong spot. But the AR-4 kind of has a problem where it kind of mounts the laser in a point where the bayonet lug is as well but i don't know what else to do here i do know one gun that is like crazy to use where is it at it's a world war ii version weapon smg it's a smg okay here you go boom boom this is gonna look stupid because the gun basically okay so this gun we used in the video before what that what i'm saying is why it's weird to use or something i forgot, I forgot what i was saying but like anyway like the gun is like weird in a sense because while the gun, right where the bayonet's sitting, this, I don't know if this piece here, I don't know if this piece is a bayonet lug, or what is this little tip. Like here, let me put the bayonet back on. See that tip there? That little tiny tip? I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's like that tiny tip there that the bayonet is sitting on, and when I, when I remove it, drop it, there it is right there. It's weird. It doesn't even look like a part of a bayonet, but this is like insane. Why is that so much bigger than the grand's like muzzle? Actually, it's about the same size. Why are the muzzle brakes so so small? What else should I use? I'm not gonna pay. I'm not paying. I got the last pistol as the worst pistol, but we're just gonna try this because this looks stupid. And it's like, wait, you can add a grip on here. Wait, can you add grips? Oh, you can. Sweet. Um, what grip do I want to add? I think I just want to add the standard scar grip. Or, no, I think I want to go for it. No, I'm not paying for that grip. Eh, uh, that's what we'll do. It looks ugly, but fine. Okay, we're going to do this again at the train yard, just because of how stupid this is. This is so dumb. Why am I doing this? I can see why Germany used this weapon, which I I can see why. But after the First World War and Second World War, here's the thing, guys. You know what happened in Germany? This is kind of like a history thing for the history people. So if you don't want to hear this, mute this video for the next 10 seconds or so. So basically, Germany, uh, basically after they were after they were defeated in both world wars, they decided to stop spending their their like their money on military spending. And mostly, uh, just move to economy spending. It's kind of, it's kind of crazy how that happened, though. Because I did not think Germany would do that. We kind of just buffed up our military for, for protection against the, the, like, you know, countries who are dictators. And we're trying to protect ourselves. But I can see why Germany stopped doing that. We just stopped doing it as well, but, like, all of us are in agreement. U.S., like, all countries are in the, uh, mess of, like, NATO, which, honestly, U.S. left NATO for reasons, due to Europe not spending their own military and using us as, like, using U.S. and people, uh, using Americans as, um, bait, or something, or military spending. Everyone knows. If you don't know what I'm talking about, go check it out online. But, I don't know. 
But anyways, guys, I think that's going to wrap up for this episode. Make sure to like, subscribe, turn on notifications. See you guys next time. Yeah.